Up next on Channel 4 is Countdown, but now get your judging shoes on for a brand new episode of Crib Critics. On Adir's episode, tensions rise. I just can't believe they said that. Get off your phone, Chris Manners. No one's watching. As four rival couples compete to win the ultimate prize. They must have a cat, darling. I don't like cats. And personalities begin to clash. The useless sod. Welcome to Crib Critics, the show where the couples judge each other's houses in the hope of winning the title of best house and a £1,000 prize. On today's episode, we're in the historical town of Ware. Ware has been occupied since 4000 BC and is one of the oldest occupied sites in Europe. The first house is owned by Anna and Charlotte, but this will be kept secret from the rest of the group. This is couple number one. Amber and Chris have been together for two and a half years and are happily living in their new home in Hartford. Here comes couple number two, Charlotte and Anna, who together own a small corner shop selling trinkets and knickknacks. Couple number three, Christian and Lauren from St Albans. Lauren is an executive accountant and Christian is a high court judge. Finally, couple number four, Adam and Chloe. Adam is a self-employed artist and they'd be viewing this house alone. Unfortunately, my wife can't be here today because she's too lazy to get out of bed, the useless sod. I need some glass then, I'll coast her. I'll give over. Oh, pathetic. Oh, pathetic. Get off your phone, Chris. Manners. No one's watching. Manners. What? what? Hi, are you alright? Hello. Hi, my name's Anna. Hi, I'm Hi, Hi, I'm 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 Hi, Hi, oh, Anna. Hi, 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 I think we're a bit too close, darling. I think the tad is. I'm just going to move out this. I have to say, the lesbians, darling. Yes. I smell a homophobe. In fact, I haven't seen one for months. No, no, neither have I. Funny people, the lesbians, aren't they? Yeah, the gay is awfully strange. Do you want to say something? Yeah, it's rather strange, yes. I mean, Mary's daughter yes. apparently is a lesbian, but yeah. I mean, what I'm not. Uh, excuse me. Hello, lads. Looks like Adam's arrived just in nice time. Oh, Hello, boss. What's your name? Chris. You. Nice to meet you, Adam. Hello. Hello. What's funny? Hands you have. Oh, yeah. Hello. 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 Chris and Lauren, it was so unfair what they said. I mean, who they to judge? They're posh idiots. Well, I don't have quite a bad opinion on lesbians myself, actually. Ever since I was attacked by one outside of a shop, I've just never felt the same about them. Stop lying. That isn't true, is it? Well, it is true. Yeah. Don't, don't, do don't know why I'm Do you have any problems with anything? I mean, we've just never really seen the gays before. Not a lot of queers around nowadays. Oh, okay. Okay, but I'll go. I mean, is it just for the... Fashion, I mean, it's the 21st century. People are gay, they just have to get over it. I oh, know. I can't believe they disrespected us like that. I mean, it's just bang out of order. Enjoy it. Lauren, um, can, you, can, you, can you both stop? I think you're making me feel uncomfortable here. There's something wrong with this. Can you feel uncomfortable? <laughs> I don't even know what a lesbian is. Let's, let's just, just, let's just begin with okay. it. <laughs> we'll leave it. Okay. So let's get a real thing. People are gay. Yeah, people are really 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 gay. Yeah, I mean, and it, we, di we didn't mean to cause offence in, in any way, no, shape or form. Not. No, no, no. no. Um, but it's just rather unnatural, isn't it, darling? Who collects toys? Do you know how much dust they collect? What's the point in the cupboards? Oh, beautiful cupboards. I really like the glass. Yes, yes. It's very see-through indeed. Oh, yes. I wonder what they have in their cupboards. Yes. I wait there. Oh, my goodness me. Some cat treats. They must have a cat, darling. I don't like cats. I love cats, darling. You never told me. 
so lovely. Oh my goodness me. Ornamental tables. They might not be so cool after all. I mean, there have been no Yankee candles anywhere. Yeah. I'm just appalled. Oh, not one. I know you love The this. chandelier in the living room. Not it's even the chandelier. It's like from, they bought it from probably Ikea. From next home or yeah. Laura Ashley. How disgusting. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I get mine personally designed in France. Why yeah. can't they do that? Yeah. Oh, what a shame. What a shame. Do you think they'd have... They had nice ornamental tins, they didn't they, darling? I'd rather like them, especially the McVitie's tin. Are they my favourites? After the break, a lack of Yankees upsets Lauren. That's a home store candle. That's not a Yankee candle, darling. Adam tries his luck with Anna. This is very nice. Not as nice as you, though. <laughs> Do you know what orchids are a sign of? What? The lesbians. 